Alright, I hope everyone can hear me. I'm just using the microphone that's uh, built into my laptop to pick up my voice. I just made a recording like 20 minutes long, but I can't I can't upload it because I had the music, the in-game music too loud. No one could hear anything that I'm saying over the music. But I got my uh, I got these headphones on. I don't want to take them off because I haven't used them at all for three years. Bought them like five years ago, and um, they were just sitting on a shelf at my dad's house for like two years because I left them there. I moved to China. I couldn't carry them with me. They come in this box. I had them like ship. I had them ship them out to me. They're the only thing I didn't want to. It's a huge box. Let me, let me put it in front of my body. <laughs> Anyways, like twenty-five hundred dollar headphones, and uh, I moved to China and only brought with me what I could carry with me. Didn't bring those, but he shipped them to me. He shipped them to me. Year ago, year and a half ago or something, but I haven't actually used them until I started to use them yesterday. But that's why, that's why I'm not using a, a real mic. I got a real mic, but I'm just gonna use a built-in one on my on my laptop. Okay, so here we go. I got the Azure Wrath. I got the Azure Wrath, and we're gonna do some gameplay. Of the Azure Wrath, but you know what? I actually, I think my highest key that I have is only 50. Wait, do that again. Oh, 53? The mobs might be. Well, mobs might survive long enough in 53. So you can see some, uh, see some frozen mobs, see some Azure Wrath action. So I got, I'm using two attack skills, so you both have 62% lucky hit chance, but then I have lucky hit on a ring and on my bracers. So I've got another like 20, 20 something percent, so I got like 80% times, I almost, I almost have 20% chance on hit to, to freeze, because your lucky hit chance base of your of your weapon skill times the lucky hit percent chance on the Azure Wrath. But I mean, I'm always, if I'm packing, if I'm packing up monsters, grouping up monsters, and I'm hitting five, six, seven, eight at a time, I'm always going to be freezing one. All right, let's see, let's see what happens. I can do, I can do pretty much any of these maps as long as they're not resource burned. So I don't even look at the maps. I do it all. Just, uh, I just run the highest ones of whatever drops. I was doing like 46 to 50 ones, but now I can do like several resources that I can get. He unfroze it. He unfroze it. <laughs> what? You dropped the key already? I just opened this map. Usually, you just rush the key to open the gate. That's the first thing I got. That's the first thing I got when I came in here. All right, where's the gate at? Run well, past all these mobs. Turn off the loot for now. So people can see the freeze action. Okay, here we go. Now there's no monsters. There's really no monsters. Let's collect the animus, so there should be some monsters. There's some big bad monsters. I know you can't see the other right hand of my screen to see the mini map. But I'm glad you okay, here's a Here's the skull. Here's the skull. Let's go for this. Let's go for this. Yeah, 
I should have gone. You know what I should have done? This density is, uh, you get the best density there. Get the win. I guess it opens that door. That's the urn. Is that door? Okay. No. No more. You get an animus dude around here somewhere. Where's the animus at? Oh, here's the shrine. Maybe this is the cursed shrine. Nope. Kill these dudes, they get the animus. I mean, they should they should have enough life that I can get through them a couple times before the game. Dying so fast, it doesn't really get the showcase of the help, but I, 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 I played like six or seven of these since I, I just got the Azura Rat this morning. I've never seen it freeze, so um, never seen it freeze the boss once. So maybe, maybe the uh, dungeon uh, guardians can't be stunned. I'll probably have minor effects like that. Um, like slow. Probably can't be frozen or uh, or stunned. Looking at my health, I was trying to look at the mini map to see where to run next. Uh, what was I trying to say? I have a freeze duration of like 3.5 seconds, but I don't know. Okay, the next mini guy is right up there. I don't know um, if there's a reduction of your crowd control duration. Level, it's like a flat reduction. It might be looking at the difficulty selection of the game. You can only you can only list like bonus experience and bonus goal. Also, right here, this is like both these guys will group, group up at the same time. The gas I run out of fury casting you know, casting mode, but my other skills can freeze as well. That froze him. I mean he was frozen a good portion of that battle, more than more than half of it. Uh, 
The mobs are frozen, they're, when they get feared, they can't run away from you. Because the Butcher's Cleaver is kind of nice if you have if you have weapons that have a lot of uh, damage to slow. speed mod on another uh, another item other than bracers. I mean there's some legends legendary imprints you can do with attack speed but um the bracers I think I had 15% on the bracers 14.4 and then a 13.8 on the silk on the one hand it's pretty nice. I like it. And it's a sword too, it's not a two-hander, so it's nice. Two-handers have, uh, have the big mods on them, and usually, uh, usually the ancient, or sorry, the uh, unique two-handers don't have a lot of, you know, you wouldn't be using this stats, so. It's nice that this is Zerorad is the one who did it. I tried using the uh, I tried using the two handed mods, the one that does death blow and the one that does uh, steel grass, but you just you lose Work. I mean, uh, of course, if there was a two-hander that was a unique item that did something for Hammer the Ancients, it would be good, right? It's just, it's difficult to try to make any of the Weapon Mastery builds work because they have, you know, they have a cooldown. You can't just spam them. Even, even the death flow effect that it's just a reception. Sets and they can have charges and whatnot, because it just doesn't, uh, doesn't do enough damage. I, I tried playing with it a lot when I was first, the first couple of years I was playing. I didn't have to do it. I had to do it. I had to do it. I didn't have it in my glyphs level, which I do now. So, I don't know. I, I really. Oh, I can see I can see that last animus I missed on the mini map. Okay, that was the last animus I needed. But um, I really want to make an Iron Nail Strip build to work. It seems like that would be the funnest build to play. I want to get that working. But for now, I'm just going to play Hoda. I'm probably going to play Hoda solid for a couple of months. And then I want to uh, I want to make a second bar. But I'm only playing on live. It's not season. So I got this Azura bag on, on live. I see, I see it for, uh, about leveling up these uh these glyphs you don't have to click allocate you can just you can just right click it so as soon as you open the window if the one you're working on leveling is right here you just right click it a bunch of times or one time depending on what level it is how much experience you have to allocate and it just assigns it that way super fast 
So yeah, I've got to uh, run through the rift, pick up my loot because I had the had the loot show it's on the ground off, so you could better see the freeze on the screen. But yeah, that's uh, Zer Wrath. I think it's best to slot for me for this build. I think it's because it's, it's the one hand. Uh, freeze, it's got attack speed, which is super good. Core skill damage, which is nice. Non physical is the only going to uh, damage on the uh, ice. The non physical damage I'm doing is the ice proc, but um, yeah, that's that, and that's the video. I hope you could hear through my microphone. I made a 20 minute long video before this one. And I listened to it real quick before I was going to upload it, and the, the music level, the music volume was just like blaring. You couldn't hear anything I said. So that's that. This is the first time I've tried to make a make a video with uh, the built-in microphone on my laptop recording my voice. But um, yeah, I hope this one is good. And if it is, I'll be uploading it to my YouTube. That I've only I've only made like maybe twenty videos in the last six months since I started making videos again but I found the Azure Wrath I thought oh man this will be this is interesting I'll be using it I'm excited about it. I'll make a video about this so that's what I do if you're wondering I don't make videos every day or like several every week like I only make one if I if I think it's something that it's not just something that highly interests me or I think would interest other people I don't make just content just to make content just this YouTube channel was made in 2015, and it's been, other than three months in 2015, it's been completely inactive, dormant, until about six months ago. I started making some videos about EverQuest, Hero Wars, and, and now Diablo 4. So I, I've only made, like, maybe uh, 25 videos in the last six months, so I, I'm not going to be a recur. If you like what you saw, watch this all the way through till now and you heard this, you know, I'm not going to be a, if you subscribe, you probably won't get notifications that there's new videos because I'm not making, well, it was 25 videos in six months. That's like, well, that's 20, that, that, that's one, it's one a week on average. So um, anyways, that's just, that's just letting you know, I don't make content just to make content. I'm, I make content that might be interesting or interesting to me. All right, thanks a lot for watching the video. Peace.